Hello everybody, welcome to my kitchen. In this video, I'm going to show you an easy recipe for homemade macaroni salad. In other words, ensalada de coditos. If you want to learn how to make this, stay tuned and I will show you how. Let's get started with our ingredients. We will need one to two chicken breasts. I'm using one in this recipe. One piece of onion, two garlic cloves, two laurel leaves, a little bit of cilantro, some salt, and I will be using some chicken bouillon. I will also be using this brand of Albo macaroni. Now that we have that down, let's get started. In this pot, I added some water. I brought it to a boil and I'm going to be adding my chicken to that along with my piece of onion garlic, cilantro, laurel, and I'm going to cook this for about 30 minutes, then add in the salt and the chicken bouillon. I'm going to add about a teaspoon and I'm just going to stir this just to combine it together. And we're going to cook this for about 40 minutes until the chicken is done. And what I'm going to do, remove the chicken along with everything that's in there. I also went ahead and just strained it because we are going to be using the same water broth to cook our macaroni. Place the broth back into the pot. Add in your macaroni. I also like to add in a little bit of oil so that the macaroni does not stick. And we're gonna cook this until al dente, about 10 to 12 minutes. In this pot, I added water. I'm going to add in my carrots. Cover this and cook 10 minutes. Now, once the chicken has cooled, I'm going to go ahead and shred it. I also like to chop this up into smaller pieces. After all, it's a macaroni salad and I don't like bigger pieces in my macaroni salad. Now for the other ingredients, we are going to need one can of table cream, about four tablespoons of mayonnaise, about three tablespoons of sour cream or Mexican crema, the two carrots that I previously cooked, half a can of corn, half a can of peas, some pepper, salt, and garlic powder and some diced ham. I'm going to be using about a teaspoon of mustard and of course don't forget your tostadas or your saladitas to accompany this nice delicious macaroni with. So we're going to get started here in a bowl going to add in the table cream, the whole can, adding in the mayo, the sour cream, we're going to whisk this well together, make sure it's all incorporated in there, add in the mustard,
and sprinkle in some garlic powder. Add your salt. Add your pepper. And we're gonna whisk this in again. Remember that all these ingredients are to your liking. You can add or subtract some of it. Now we're going to add in the macaroni, our chicken, the ham, and we are going to mix this together. Remember to mix from the bottom to the top. If you mix it on the top, your macaroni is going to cut and add in your carrots, your corn, and your peas. Give this another stir, making sure to incorporate everything all together. Now what you're gonna do is you're gonna taste it and if you feel that you need a little bit more of this or that, go ahead and add it. I added in a little bit of more salt, pepper, sour cream, mayonnaise, added more vegetables, so on and so forth. Now at the end, you can add onion if you wish. You don't have to add the onion. I happen to like it with the onion. So dice up your onion if you're gonna add it. And toss that right in. Give this another quick stir and your macaroni is done. Don't forget, we'll see you in my next video. Serve it with tostadas. With your saladitas. Or what the heck, why not serve it with both, right? Super delicious either way. I want to thank you for watching. Bye.